Now, again, when graphing this, ladies and gentlemen, you can see here, 2x plus 5, we should not have a problem graphing 2x plus 5. We go to the y-intercept, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, make a nice little dot. The slope is 2 over 1. So you can go up 2 over 1. Or you can go down 2 to the left 1. And either way, you see there's a graph that kind of looks something like that. Right? However, if we look at this, it says graph this function, but for all values except when x equals 0. So even though we know at 0 there's that intercept at y equals 5, when we look up here on the board, we can see that that's actually going to be represented as a whole. Right? Then it says at x equals 0, we want the function to equal negative 1. So that's our second constraint. So we go down to negative 1, and we put a nice little dot. So what this is is this is a function with a hole, but then its value at 0 is not up there. It's all the way down there at negative 1. Okay? So when you're evaluating the function, you know, for instance, f of negative 1, we're basically looking at the function. What, fun what is this function's value at negative 1? Well, if you look at the graph, you can see at negative 1, there's a point there. right? What is that value? All you need to do is plug in negative 1 into the function. You could probably see this on the graph. And what you'd see is that answer is 3. So f of negative 1 is equal to 3. If you want to do 5, well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Mm, that might be a little too high off the graph for me to do. So the easy way to understand that would just be to multiply times 5 plus 5. 2 times 5 is 10, plus 5 is equal to 15. All right. Then last but not least is going to be doing f of 0. Well, we have an issue. We can't use this function for f of 0 because it says x cannot equal 0. Well, if you look at the graph, what is the function equal to at 0? Negative 1. No math is needed, or no algebra is needed. You can just evaluate equals negative 1. Yeah. Because that's, that's what the function, remember the function contains both of those uh, 